hold on dogs <laughs> so anyways today I am going to be giving you guys an advice video because I needed help with this and I always need help with this so this is basically going to be a how to get over someone slash how to cut ties with someone so this could be a friend this could be a boyfriend this could be a girlfriend this could be a family member anything like that if you just want to cut ties with them and you're like or they cut ties with you this is just how to get over it so because i'm an expert at that let's give this a little backstory so i have dealt with guys not liking me back or they're just like not a good person so i stopped liking them if that makes any sense and so getting over them is the most hardest thing that you will ever do in your life probably not it's extremely hard to get over them when they're always on your mind constantly 24 7. a this is um something that i had to go through when i went through a breakup and i remember i was in therapy and the, ther the therapist told me or the counselor or whatever she told me straight up just tell them how you feel and tell them that you're not going to talk to them anymore this really really helped me because sometimes i feel like if you don't want to talk to the person anymore but they don't know that it's going to keep you wondering like oh like do they know that like oh like is that how they feel or whatever so just automatically tell them hey i liked you but you're a big jerk you did this this and this and this and you really hurt me so i'm going to stop talking to you i need to get over you something like that or if you don't like want to text it to them write a letter to them like write everything that they did wrong anything like that and then burn it <laughs> like just anything to just get everything that they did everything that the reason why you don't want to like them with a reason that you need to move on just get it out you know i've done that so many times number two the biggest thing the biggest advice that i can give to you is out of sight out of mind this such a good thing like out of sight out of mind doesn't necessarily mean to block them or whatever because that can be kind of excessive because if you like want to be friends with them later on that's another thing is don't be friends with them right away like if you want to stop just don't talk to them don't be friends with them and like if you know if they're if they're friends with your friends then like don't make it like such a big deal but still like you don't want to be friends right away because that could just make your feelings even more stronger and it sucks <laughs> So don't be friends with them right away. Give it time. I would say like give it to like two, like four to six months of just like not talking to them. So like not Snapchatting them, not FaceTiming them, not texting them, not talking to them in person really helps. And it's really hard to do that when you're in high school because, you know, if you have a class with them, you see them every single day. So that can be really difficult. So just don't talk to them. And most likely if they're not, in your site so like if they're not like if you don't see them on instagram all the time if you don't see them on snapchat or anything like that then most likely you'll forget about them and be like oh yeah i forgot about that it's just really hard to move on to be quite honest with you because it depends on how hard your feelings were and with friends it can be very difficult just because like i haven't really lost a friend by like you did this to me it wasn't like that it was just more of like we don't see each other anymore and it's just like there's like no hard feelings so i don't really know like if you like want to end a friendship with someone that's really hard and this is more of like crush or like someone that you dated another way that i would say to move on is to focus on someone else so that could be like Oh, like I want to focus on myself or you, that could be like I want to focus on my friends I want to focus on another guy that is another way to help it because you can be like oh like I'm gonna put more of my focus on this person than the person that I'm trying to get over that's what I did and like this guy really hurt me and the, what I did was I wanted to focus on myself so I wanted to make myself feel better like have like 
more self-love if that makes sense so I wanted to focus on myself so I did that and yeah it worked great love myself just kidding <laughs> I still have rough days but like just focus on something else other than the person that could be literally anything that could be music that could be anything just like focus on whether that's school like don't so much after you know getting over someone don't just focus on oh i need to get in another relationship blah 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 like i have a really hard time with this because i just like to jump in quick right after like if i need to get over someone i can do it right away but this last time i did it and it really helped me i took like like two to three months off of focusing on like oh like i want a relationship blah blah blah, blah. like no like i just really focus on myself and let things go with the flow you know it really helped it's super hard to get over someone and honestly it takes like four to six months as i said and it takes a long time trust me but it'll be worth it in the end because the reason that you need to get over this person is probably for a darn good reason yeah just really think of like that reason and you're golden well i love you guys i hope you have a really good day and yeah